This tutorial uh, is a screencast specially made to help you publish a page in WordPress. Now, for those who are not aware, um, pay, making pages in WordPress is different from posts. Uh, posts are the way you can do fresh content like blog posting. Now pages are more static and uh, this is an uh, ability that uh, was uh, secondary to posts uh, after uh, WordPress itself actually began and it was to help people be able to make more content without actually having to disturb their theme or make actual static HTML or PHP pages. This actually allows you to actually use WordPress itself to publish the pages. So, if you've already uh, looked into the WordPress backend, you'll see on your, your uh, left side you have posts media, links, and then pages. And you actually just have a few uh, by default even in even if you have already tried to uh, tinker with Word, you know your own WordPress, um, you have a few options. You have just uh, pages where actually this is your pa pages and then uh, for newer versions, it usually has uh, sample pages, or for those who haven't updated from an older version, it still has about uh, for a sample, sample page. Now you have uh, also add new um, as another thing. But if you know for quick reference, if you're already in that page, you also have a button that says add new. So we're going to go ahead and click on the add new button. Like I said, it doesn't really matter because even if you click on the add new button, if you see right here, it actually highlights and bolts. So you know where you need to be. So, just like in a po making a post, and I've already created a tutorial for that, and it says add new page. And you enter the title page here. Say you want to put a camp. Uh, contact. Now, unfortunately, I don't have a uh, fancy uh, plugin for a contact form, so we're just going to type something in uh, to contact me. Uh, email me at mail at blogish dot net. Oops, net. So. You know, we have that down and everything, and, uh, you know, you can put, uh, say you ha have a theme that has different templates, and maybe uh, you either have one, two, or three columns. Some people have all kinds of, uh, you know, theme temp templates, so uh, um, you can, uh, you know, put your page attributes, like, say, your contact form you know, pages under another one. But, you know, a lot of people really don't have their contact page as a minor page. It's usually a primary, you know, menu page. Uh, so that's not a problem. So then you can, you know, do your, you know, template and everything. And there's a selection for that. And uh, considering WordPress, WordPress 3.0, you really don't really have to look at order anymore. So I wouldn't worry about that. And some themes actually might allow you to select a featured image. So uh, once you're done, you can click publish. And uh, once you're done, um, WordPress will uh, have in this little yellow highlight box, it'll say page published and view page. And then you can view page. So uh, even in the tw in the default 2010 theme, you will have a page, and it should publish exactly how you put it. So uh, that's how you publish a page in WordPress.